Since I moved to America as a teenager, I have known the ultimate truth here is I can be whoever I want to be. So, I'm abandoning my Chinese name. It's not a preference, it's a must. Life isn't always as perky as it seems here as an Asian woman. Something as simple as my Chinese name can throw a huge curveball at my goal to live a happy life. Before you make a quick judgment, I love my culture. Come on, look at my life. All my friends are Chinese. Well, almost. But this name is making my life harder than it has to be. Oh, hi, can I have an Americano, please? Thank you. And the name for the order? It's Jie Chen. Oh! I know, I know, this looks trivial. Americano, please. But it really is killing so many chances for me. Wait, so what's your name? Oh, it's Jie Chen. What? Jie Chen. Huh? Jie Qian! Jie Qian! Yeah! Sure! Told you I could pronounce your name! It's even getting in the way of my career, and inflation is not my best friend. My friend tells me that statistically, an English name helps me advance a lot easier. And as a Korean woman, nothing stands in my way. Not even my Chinese name! After all, who's going to stop me? My female general ancestor in? <laughs> How dare you change your name? Change it back. Stay away, I uh I I have a gun. No you don't. Change your name back. You're in? Oh my god, so you're real? How did you get into my room? And have you have you always been around? This is a little bit crazy. You know that, right? Unimportant. I'm here to remind you of your cultural roots. So have you met Monkey King if you are real? Wait, is he even real? Or is it real? I guess it's non-binary, right? Because he was born out of a giant rock. So it is true that young kids today all have ADHD. I don't have ADHD. I mean, <gasps> do you know everything about my life? Only if I choose to look inside. <gasps> Are ghosts real too? And what sets ghosts and gods apart? Because ghosts can become gods and live in heavenly court, right? So what's the difference? We are unionized. Okay, I assume you already know I have so many questions, but I can't ask all of them right now. I've got an interview in an hour and traffic sucks right now, and driving is so stressful. I can't deal with all that. And I ate hay for three days to survive famine 600 years ago. I'm sorry, Ying. I can't let you change my name. This is not my coffee. Aren't you supposed to be watching over me or something? I've never said that. But I'm lactose intolerant. Then why are you drinking a Qfina's latte? Oh my god! Yes? <sighs> Hello! Hi! It's um, really nice to be here. Jessie? Yeah! You've got a such a nice office. It makes people feel really relaxed. <laughs> Thank you, Michelle. We are very proud of our design here as well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anyways. So it's uh, Jessie Xiao, right? Yeah. You are stressing her Asian last name. No, that's her full name. That's a bit rude. You said it first. Um, so what I was trying to say is, I... <laughs> I just said... Excuse me! Interesting lady. Do you see what you did? What? She's not upset. 
Maybe she just has massive diarrhea. I mean, I would walk out if I had massive diarrhea. Told you the coffee was bad. Kids never listen to the wise words of their seniors. Lactose intolerance. I wouldn't have chucked that coffee if you didn't just pop out of nowhere. I was beside myself. <clears throat> the only thing beside you was me. Well, thanks to you, this interview is wasted too. You happy now? Wow, Jesse didn't get a job, huh? What a surprise! Oh, my bag. I don't think she's coming back. I really like her resume. I do like a woman who attends to her priorities. Uh. <laughs> Jesse? Gentlemen. I can't believe I lost this over some shit like this. You are quite a little person, aren't you? My god, can you just leave me alone? Jay, oh my god, hi! Hi, Boran. Well, actually, it's spring now. I was so stressed out by how people turning down my job application yeah. and how Cher was saying, my name has a huge part in this. Think about it. Who would want to hire someone who sounds like boring? Well, I changed to bring across all my platform, even my WeChat. And I will tell you, my friend, you are looking at the new product manager of Bed Bath & Below. Wow, congrats, Bryn. That's a uh, quite a cool name. Oh, Andy Hoosis, I will see you later, alligator. Bye. Hmm, she wants to be white. Do you read minds? No, it's just really obvious. Right. It's like they're our parents, you know, and they never even try to understand how hard it is for our generation. Yeah, right? It's like, uh, we gave birth to you and we've lived longer, but it's not their world anymore, you know? I mean, the struggle for Asian Americans is different now. Yeah, my parents say that to me all the time when I try to give them insights on our hindrances to success. Look, guys, I think each generation has their own problems. Mine is different from yours, but it doesn't make it easier or harder. Your name, honestly, Jishan, is probably not as big of a hurdle as you've made it out to be. Well, I didn't... Yeah, I think you all have made really valid points. I mean, name is just a label, right? Like, like so many other things. Like, just love yourself. You know, don't question who you want to be. Even if you don't really understand who you want to be. And don't question yourself either. Oh my god, guys! Guys, guys! I got the job! Oh my god! Congratulations. Congratulations! Thank you! You know, I thought I totally bombed the interview, but here they said I had excellent background. Mm -hmm. And great sense of priority. Oh, hey, get this! I'm exactly what they're looking for. <laughs> oh my god, I told you it was gonna work! Yeah, I know! Yeah, I've always believed in you. Oh, yeah! First spring and now me? This country is sick and it's so wrong! Bring? Boran, I told her to change her name and see, it worked! Yeah, thank you! Nice. Yeah, I'm so glad I listened to you. <laughs> Look, cheers to that! Yeah! So, Jesse, mm -hmm. I just want to welcome you to the company. I mean, thanks for hiring me. I really love this company. <laughs> so, just curious, is Jesse your real name? Ooh. 